Good afternoon, dear chairs and dear colleagues. Uh, today's topic um, uh, appeared uh, because our patients want quick and effective solution, and the Russian thread lifting school is one of the best. Why is it so? Because uh, we uh, see the beauty of the face. We do not simply uh, transpose tissues. Uh, we uh, improve uh, facial appearance and uh, using the classification using the classification by Dr. Grustev, we know uh, different types of threads for skin tightening, for skin vectoring, and uh, for beautification. Today, I will talk about. Uh, um, uh, single treatment session um, for beautification. Let's imagine that we have adult patient or middle-aged patient, but visually she sees herself as a, a girl and she does not notice um, her major concerns. She will talk about nasolabial faults, about downward corners of the mouth, about her problems with the jawline, but she will never touch uh, the issue of descent, eyebrow descent, hollow um, temples, uh, skeletonized um, orbital rim. And that is why when I'm talking about the fact that when we perform thread lift, we should use synergistically other surgical techniques, other uh, aesthetic treatment techniques to obtain beautiful result. So we should not just uh, transpose tissues uh, upwards. Many cosmetologists, when they see their regular patients, they uh, use uh, this um, view. And, uh, and here we cannot see some problems of the patient because when patient lies down, we do not see um, bulging fat compartments, uh, skin uh, texture improves. Therefore, we have to analyze our patient in um, vertical position. And thus, we can calculate uh, the transposition vectors. Skin aging is a complex process. It, uh, it is the same as three-dimensional domino, not only skin and subcutaneous fat. Uh, ages. Uh, we um, we see also res bony tissue resorption, and we have to remember about it when we transpose tissues. Also, uh, we see aging of the muscles. And since we work at the level of, of subcutaneous fat, when we introduce threads, uh, we perform transposition of fat compartments, and thus we see uh, hypertrophy of uh, certain fat compartments and atrophy of other compartments. We see uh, aging changes at the age of 25 and older, and the, the sooner patients come to us, the better result we can get because ideal patient for this technique is uh, not a not very old patient. It, it is patient without significant skin access, with minimal gravitational ptosis. And um, if we remember classification of gravitational ptosis, we can say that stage one, grade one, is uh, our patients uh, belong to grade one category. When we uh, can replenish the missing volume, and patient can go back to normal life uh, immediately after the treatment. However, grade two patients uh, um, display uh, some skin excess, tissue excess, and when we transpose tissues using threads, we will get uh, quite significant uh, folds, uh, bulges uh, at the um, wrapper points, anchoring points. And not all patients can afford it. And therefore, for these patients, we should combine techniques to get um, better result and uh, to minimize downtime. 
Thread lift is minimally invasive treatment, and if downtime uh, lasts longer than uh, plastic surgery downtime, uh, so it's better not to take such patients for correction because one of the most important for uh, things for patients is quick downtime grade 3 gravitational ptosis uh, when i have such patients i uh, recommend not to transpose tissues significantly uh, we have to just visually improve uh, um, aging changes uh, like marionette lines and as labial folds because uh, over tightening of the tissues uh, will not give them a nice aesthetic results. These are more surgical patients. And for each age, we should uh, choose um, different treatments. It, if in patients with initial aging changes, we can offer vitamin complexes, fillers, some professional skin care treatments, for middle-aged patients, we can offer um, all the whole armamentarium of our treatments, and we, and our uh, main objective is to slow down the aging changes, but not to reverse the time. And uh, patients aged 45 and older, we have to slow down the visual aging changes. And at the same time, we, should, we could offer a wide range of professional treatments. In terms of clinical efficiency, uh, we can divide uh, those treatments into high, medium, and low efficiency procedures. Thread lifts are in the high efficiency category, and we should, we should not start, use them for initial treatment. We should start from with skin quality. If we talk about the second group of our patients, we, in addition to skin quality, we should uh, um, uh, activa activate regenerative regeneration processes. And in group three, uh, the most important thing is to improve overall facial appearance and to beautify patients. What do cosmetologists expect from thread lifts? They expect it to be reasonably priced because specialists should get income. Uh, the product, uh, the used product should be certified. It should be easily handled because uh, and uh, threads with complex threads with complex design normally are very traumatic and uh, therefore these products are not in great demand i'd like to introduce main threads uh, that These uh, threads produced using new technology without cutting, but forming of cogs, uh, thanks to press molding barbs. And uh, the the barbs have uh, good tissue fixation. We see the molding process. Mint uh, thread has solid body and quite high uh, and. Um, nicely fixing a cog which is located at, at the um, uh, spirally so we have fixation throughout the length of threads we have threads of 43 centimeters and 17 centimeters 17 centimeter threads these are threads that are uh, in uh, that are initially located in the, inside the cannula and 43 centimeter threads provide great opportunities for trans tissue transportation uh, polydioxanone is a safe poly biodegradable product uh, it biodegrades throughout the year Mint threads are designed to restore youthfulness and beauty to our patients. 
age groups. I have described age groups, but unfortunately, not always we see ideal candidates in our practice, and we have to to handle to deal with patients, and not always we have time to um, to um, prepare the. Um, this video shows um, filler Equio filler injection. This is a unique product by Italian company, which allows us uh, to create soft volume without demarcation lines. I like this filler for. Um, for temporal area for hands where bony tissue is in close proximity we mark temporal area then we uh, should define fat compartments um, at uh, we uh, lose uh, superbrow fat compartments and temporal fat and we have to replenish these tissues otherwise when we uh, transpose tissues we will have so-called well, waistline uh, in the temporal area which is not particularly beautiful therefore when we um, perform this treatment we should uh, replenish the volume and after that transpose tissues we will use threads and filler uh, uh, we uh, uh, use uh, anesthesia of uh, entry holes and uh, um, anesthesia of um, thread uh, courses I normally use non-concentrated solu ultra cane solution I uh, add uh, sodium bicarbonate and add saline to increase diffusion. And uh, if I have, um, uh, um, sus if I suspect that patient is prone to swelling and inflammation, here you see the uh, anesth anesthetizing um, stage. I could also add dexamethasone. I normally use no more than six milliliters per side. This is enough for ideal anesthesia of this area. And uh, this anesthesia should not long last, uh, last longly. В области средней трети позволяет лучше распределиться раствору. Вот данную точку э, великолепно можно использовать для лифтинга брови, заполнения надбровного э, пространства, восполнения обратно. И также из этой зоны очень хорошо можно уйти, собственно, э, в сам э, висок. А поскольку филер Эквио не имеет демаркационных линий, э, контурированных тяжей вы никогда не будете получать. То есть распределяется все буквально за один прием. And then we uh, use uh, threads when we replenished the superior volume. This is the cannula with mandrel. It is easily advanced in the tissues, but it is automatic. Automatic, therefore, we do not damage any uh, important um, anatomical structures, arteries, or nerves. We tighten uh, the threads immediately. They, the fixating effect is wonderful. I've been using all the th threads that are present on the market, but this is the uh, I, I cannot compare this uh, thread with any other thread. When we introduce a thread inside the cannula, you should rotate it a little bit because, as you remember, the barbs are located. Um, uh, at um, uh, in a spiral with 360 degrees. Now we um, gather tissues on top of the cannula. Uh, here we will demonstrate only treatment of mid face, mi middle third. And um, next time, for the next event, I will show you uh, lower third. So. 
as this is quite traumatic treatment we do not perform all at once so this is the end of the video and the end of my uh, presentation then uh, in vertical position we tighten the threads uh, we cut the threads in a way so that um, the um, tips should be buried thoroughly and this is the result of the treatment and a few words uh, about uh, about combined treatment in other patients this is 38 um, 38 year old patient v lift um, frontal view and side view we see initial gravitational changes this patient is not ideal candidate but we see nice result because we combined uh, lost tissue volumes using filler and threads and also we had one clinical case of male patient but uh, my laser pointer is not working <laughs> therefore probably i won't be able to show you our male patient men are normally self-conscious unfortunately i can't list uh, this slide um, men uh, um, deserve separate uh, presentation and now I thank you for your attention